He is known for his extensive involvement in concert activities from 1969 to 1983. He performed in jazz orchestras and was a lead saxophonist and arranger in the State Orchestra of Azerbaijan. His name is Yuri Chernavsky. In the world of music, there are legends who leave an indelible mark on the industry. One such legend is Yuri Chernavsky, a Russian composer, producer, and musician whose career spanned from 1969 to 1983. During this time, Chernavsky immersed himself in the world of concerts and performances, captivating audiences with his talent and passion. In the early years of his career, from 1969 to 1973, Yuri showcased his skills as a saxophonist in jazz orchestras led by renowned musicians such as Boris Rensky, Oleg Lundström, and Leonid Yudyasov. His exceptional talent caught the attention of the music scene, and in 1973, he became the lead saxophonist and arranger for the prestigious State Orchestra of Azerbaijan. This orchestra, comprised of the finest jazz stars in the Soviet Union, provided Chernavsky with an opportunity to shine on a grand stage. But it was in 1976 that Chernavsky entered a new chapter of his musical journey. He took on the role of musical director, working with various vocal instrumental ensembles and rock and pop groups. His collaborations with Soviet groups like Fantasy, Krasny Maki, Carnival, Dynamic, and Vesely Rebiata showcased his versatility and range as a musician. Chernavsky's compositions and arrangements were deeply rooted in mainstream music, R&B, and electrofusion, setting him apart from the heavy rock scene of the time. In addition to his work in the music industry, Chernavsky also made significant contributions to the world of cinema. He collaborated with esteemed directors such as Georgi Junwald Hilkovich, Sergei Solovyov, and Valery Pendrakovsky, composing soundtracks for over 20 animated cartoons. His close partnership with renowned animators Igor Kovalev and Alexander Tatarsky allowed him to create captivating and memorable music that enhanced the storytelling experience. In the 1994, Yuri Chernavsky made a bold move and ventured into the world of Hollywood. He teamed up with his older son Damon to establish a company called LA 3D Motion. Damon was a master of computer graphics technology, particularly CGI, which was widely used in the video movie industry. With Chernavsky as a producer, Damon's creative team became experts in computer movie FX, collaborating with various companies in Hollywood. Hashtag continue hashtag Damon's talent and hard work paid off when he received recognition on his 18th birthday at the MTV Awards. He was honored for his exceptional work on the music video, Get Down, by the Backstreet Boys. This was just the beginning of his successful career, as he went on to work with other renowned groups such as, NSYNC, The Boys, Rod Stewart, Tupac Shakur, and Dance Jam, among others. Damon's expertise also led him to collaborate with independent corporate FX groups, including the prestigious Digital Domain, led by the world-renowned movie director James Cameron. Hashtag continue hashtag meanwhile, Yuri Chernavsky played a vital role as an executive producer for the Dance Jam Project in Hollywood, CA. He forged close relationships with influential figures in the music industry, such as Dionne Warwick's son Damon Elliott and Jermaine Jackson from the Jackson family. Chernavsky also maintained strong connections with renowned recording studios and companies like Red Square Studios, Track Records, Ambience Music Group, Picasso Records, EMI, and Sony. Hashtag continue hashtag Yuri Chernavsky's passion for the international music business continued to thrive as he collaborated with young American and European singers, musicians, movie actors, and directors. His travels and experiments in the field of music business allowed him to explore new territories and create meaningful connections that contributed to his ongoing success in Hollywood. Do you want to explore more composers? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.